Hello friends, welcome back. We just got back from month long grocery shopping. The girls had a eyebrow appointment. We had a bunch of other stops to make and so I'm just now opening the video after we already got home. So I'm going to show you Sam's Club, Aldi, and Meyer. Those are the three stores that we went to today. We had some other stops just for some random stuff. And then I do have something coming from Sam's Club online. If I remember correctly, I think it's like face moisturizer for Jason and Jericho and something else. I cannot remember. And also what I will not show you in the Sam's haul but was included in my total is um, uh, two bags of water softener salt that my husband will carry down for me that I didn't feel like hauling out of the car again. So my total was right around uh, 385 or something like that at Sam's. Um, Meyer was like 60 some and Aldi was like 180 some. I gotta count up the cash that I have left but I think I stayed pretty well on budget and whatever is left is what I will spend mid month when I go back for just some, like for Journey's volleyball team dinner, I will need like buns and some extra milk for the coffee bar and stuff like that. So, and then I just get like fresh produce. Oh, the other thing that is, um, like I don't have a ton of fresh produce because I'm going to the farm market, um, probably, the week after next, something like that for all of my apples that I like to store and make applesauce out of. So um, I save some cash for that as well. So let's do Meyer first because that's the smallest. All right, this little bit right here is Meyer. I needed these frozen egg noodles. That's for the chicken noodle soup for Journey's team dinner. Team dinner. We are having pork carnitas for dinner tonight and these just looked good these little mini um, street tacos we're having company over so that just looked good journey was with me and just really wanted the expensive pretzels this butter flavor which they already got into on the way home from sam's i've not been able to get their double pack of the potato bread that jason really likes so had to get it at um meyer but those will go right into the freezer I had a coupon for apples, otherwise I'm getting all my apples at the farm market. We like white popcorn and this was on sale and I've been hitting our popcorn in our food storage downstairs pretty hard. Because every Sunday night when the girls get back from youth group, I make popcorn or kettle corn as like a family snack. Make a big old bowl of it. Um, so I got two of those. If you've never had this, it's pretty fun. It used to have like a golden egg thing in it that would like dissolve when you made the, I don't know if it still has that or not, <laughs> I'm not sure. Um, but this is for the chicken noodle soup as well. It calls for one of those. I needed beef bouillon. This is not my favorite, but this is all that they had. The girls needed some more hair ties. Jason takes this every day. Um, we needed some more of that. This was the one thing that was not on the list, but I love this apple cider scent. And so um, I will put this out right now and save the other soap that we're using. And then just, you know, after I go through my fall scents and then my Christmas scents, I'll just pull those other ones back out. It'll be fine. Two things of petite diced tomatoes. I just cannot get the petite diced at Aldi and I just like it. Beef consomme, I've used a couple out of food storage, so that's to replace that. This is our favorite microwave popcorn. Microwave popcorn is still very unhealthy for you, but this one is the less fake option. And it's just nice to have those for when I don't make popcorn on the stove. And then I really, really like this dry shampoo. It's $10 for a pretty large um container and it's cheaper than like your other stuff still probably really bad because it's like aerosol and everything but I like this I like the dark it hides um doesn't make my hair all white and powdery so that is everything from Meyer. like I said 60 some dollars okay now we need to go over Sam's Club 
like I said, I still have a couple things coming um, online. I cannot remember what the other thing was, but that's okay. Um, and this is mostly lunch items, a little bit of meat. And then for some reason, months hit like this where we just needed a lot of toiletries and that happened to be this month. So it doesn't look like a lot of food, but I did get some higher ticket items. You will also see that I did not get Zevia because it just wasn't in the budget this time. Um, so let me show you Sam's Club. Okay, starting right here, I did go ahead and get these Body Armor lights. Um, the kids really like them in their lunches, and so instead of, I could do either or, and I decided to do this instead of Zevia because they can pack them in their lunches. Um, we, I never want to run out of these paper plates. Um, I did have a whole nother stack left, but I've pushed some things off till next month, like dishwasher soap and stuff, so I didn't want to add this to it. I'm trying to just like spread out those big ticket items. These are for lunches. Everybody likes those. They're Jericho's favorite, but everybody likes them. Completely out of Kleenex, so we needed that. This is my treat. I actually happen to love candy corn. I like it plain. I love it with peanuts. And so I have this little candy dish way over there that we will put out candy corn and peanuts. And once it's gone, it's gone. But Sam's Club was actually the best deal. I looked at a bunch of different stores, you know, like the two for four deals or whatever, but for how much you got, Sam's Club was still the best deal. I got two two packs of brats. This is for a volleyball tournament that I'm in charge of bringing the main dish, so we're gonna do brats. Two things of um, cream cheese, just trying to get a little bit ahead of the cream cheese because I make homemade bagels um, and there's some items like lunch items that I make that uses quite a bit of cream cheese and so um, we just need to stay ahead of that. Goldfish crackers, haven't gotten those in quite a while. Here's some of the toiletry items. The girls use this and Julia needs it for her Invisalign stuff. Um, doing, oh, there's some bonus stuff in here. I didn't see that. Really, I just got it for these two lotions, but it looks like there's a body wash and like a travel lotion. So hmm. that's fun. Where I'm just changing everybody over to this lotion right here. It seems to work for everyone and I can get it in this double pack at Sam's for a really good price. And then um, the Sensitive Skin Dove body wash we all like so that's three of those just needed that journey really likes honey nut cheerios i tried to get all of the kids one thing that they just really like to snack on jericho likes the flaming hot cheetos journey really likes these pretzel crisp i actually like these dipped in like the laughing cow cheese wedges those are delicious they had these again, which I haven't gotten in a while, but I remember these are a good like option for Journey because they're not made um, on equipment that uses tree nuts and stuff. It's actually really hard to find any sort of like bar that's like tree nut allergy friendly. So these will be for lunches. Big tub of sour cream. I make our ranch dressing and we do go through quite a bit of sour cream just in dinners and stuff. So. That works out well for us. I like this big thing of Parmesan cheese. I will dump half of it immediately into the, like a freezer bag and freeze it. And then we'll use what's left. And then once we run out of that, I get it out of the freezer and dump it back in here. That way it just stays really nice and fresh. I like these light string cheeses. We got that for some lunch options. Also some grapes, hopefully they're good. This is for volleyball team dinner we're doing ham and cheese roll-ups and so this is just a lunch meat is actually a pretty good price at sam's club this is the cheddar cheese that i use for everything i just shred it up i like half and half in my coffee and then i got a couple of extras for the options for the coffee bar that we're doing with team dinner big thing of romaine hearts one i think there's four packs of frozen broccoli in there. 
mini cucumbers, Rayo's marinara. I just used some out of food storage. And this is what I'm going to use, I think, for the pizza sauce for the Detroit style deep dish pizza. I think I'm just going to use that. We all really just like these carb balanced tortillas, they're delicious. This was Jericho's request, this pancake mix. He really likes it. Three things of our favorite tortilla chips. This is a gigantic bag. You really cannot beat the price for giant bags of chips. And then this is Julia's thing that she just really likes to snack on these peanut butter and filled pretzels. So that is everything from Sam's Club, minus my little online order and the water softener salt. All right, now on to Aldi. It does not feel like I got very much on here for like 180 some dollars. There's not a ton of fresh stuff either because I still have a bunch in the refrigerator that we're working through. So I'm anticipating my mid-month grocery shopping needing to get quite a few like produce items. Um, so I will explain everything. There's a bunch of stuff for team dinner in here. And most of it's just like snacking and lunch options. So let me show you Aldi. Okay, three things of eggs. I have um, the neighbor down the way is selling eggs too, which I have meant to stop, which I'll probably stop for some of their farm fresh eggs as well. But I got these just to have. This is for the ham and cheese roll ups for the volleyball dinner. I threw Jericho a bone. He just really likes to be able to like squeeze the ranch out of the container, even though I make all of our homemade ranch, like for lunch and stuff. He just prefers that. Two avocados, some mini marshmallows for peanut butter rice crispy treats, cilantro for dinner tonight, and for another dinner, I think. Onions, this is for the chicken noodle soup. We like these. The kids like to make barbecue pizzas out of them or regular pizzas for lunch. I did not need this, but I have used one out of food storage. And this is just really good pasta if you've never tried it. It's $2, just kind of pricey for pasta. But it is made out of good Durham wheat semolina. So it is really good. Um, some chocolate chips. I plan on getting my chocolate chips at Costco next time I go back, but until then, I just always like to have stuff on hand to make chocolate chip cookies because everybody loves them and it's an easy thing to bring with you if you need to bring something. Let's go back here. Um, Julia's choice of crap cereal, Jericho's choice of crap cereal until they're gone. Um, Journey got Honey Nut Cheerios. These are just crappy things for lunches back here, but I do like them because they're made in an unnut-free facility. So that's just a nice grab and go pack in your lunch option. These are just two crappy snacks that I told the kids they could have. Um, granola bars for packing lunches. And then these granola bars right here are actually for another tournament. Um, it's a very volleyball heavy month. And so I have team dinner, the main dish at a tournament, and then these granola bars for another tournament. So I just got it all done at once. Those are just like Ritz crackers. They're delicious. We got these pub style pretzels that Julia talked Journey into, some stick pretzels, only a couple of bag of potato chips because we have some left randomly. Um, saltine crackers. This is my treat. I buy these once a year and they're so, so good. They're like, win we call them windmill cookies here in Michigan because all the kind that you get, this like particular kind of cookie, they're all windmills because we're very Dutch here. So in West Michigan. So um, those are my treats that I will have with like a hot cup of tea. And when they're gone, they're gone. Julia requested some honey roasted peanuts, black beans for a recipe. I like the cocktail peanuts with the candy corn. So that's what those are for. Paper plates, just a little bit sturdier to be able to bring to the team dinners and stuff. Toilet paper. 
crinkle cut french fries, two things of riced cauliflower. I'm gonna make myself a riced cauliflower ham and cheese breakfast bake for my breakfast. Pepperoni for the Detroit style pizza. Two split chicken breasts. I actually like to roast this up. Um, peel all the meat off for the chicken noodle soup. And then you can make some bone broth with what's left. So I will do that. This is for the ham and cheese roll-ups as well. I just wanted to have extra just in case. Um, this ground turkey, I really like it. Some feminine products, one thing of sparkling water back there, just like LaCroix, a big thing of potatoes, cause I have a couple, I've got like mashed potatoes and I'm trying these um, like seasoned potato wedges. They looked really good. I don't know, we'll go back and watch my last video about my meal plan and we'll see, see how they are. Um, I let the kids pick out some sort of air fry or something and they thought Jericho and all of them would like these for like a at-home lunch option. Then we got five, which these are pricey, but for the coffee bar, I'll probably need two of them and I always get myself three for an iced coffee some afternoons. Two things of milk, which I will have to get more for the coffee bar, but I can do that in my mid-month grocery haul. Three things of mozzarella cheese, two things of Monterey Jack. I'm gonna mix the two for the Detroit style pizza. And I think that's it. This is homemade grape juice concentrate from my neighbor's grapes that is delicious, but that's not included in the grocery haul. Okay, as you can see, I have a lot of work to put all of this away. But as I always say, it's a lot of work in one day, but I'm so, so happy to have it all done. I got a pile of dishes to do back there. We're having company tonight. But this was the, the day that it worked out in the schedule. So um, I'm gonna work on getting all of this put away. And then I know I have everything that I need, minus a few fresh ingredients halfway through the month. And then all of the grocery shopping is off of my plate for the whole month and it always feels really good. Hope you enjoyed this video and we will see you in the next one. Bye. As I was putting groceries away, my online Sam's order came. So I got two of these like face creams, one for Jason and one for Jericho. I got two, these are really big. Um, this was the best deal of this liquid Benadryl. This is strictly for like, um, sort of like emergency allergy type things. The liquid hits your system a whole lot quicker. So we have quite the allergies going on in our house. Like, you know, we have an EpiPen for Journey, but Jalea is the only one of our kids that has never been stung by a bee. And um, we might, we suspect she might have issues if she ever were. Anyway, like, yeah, if you're stung a bunch of times by bees or whatever, um, just a good emergency thing to have on hand. And then Jericho has really been liking this, these in his school lunch. It's like three individual bags in here. So that was included in my Sam's total, and it just happened to come online to my door as I was putting my Sam's order away. Mm -hmm.